Okay, uh, we're going to solve this one. Uh, we want to get the x's on the same side, the side where they're positive, so we're going to take 2x off both sides and we're going to get 3x minus 4 equals 2x is gone equals 7. Then we're going to add 4 to both sides, so 3x equals 11. So x equals 11 over 3. Um, 11 over 3, or uh, we can simplify it and we can call that uh, 3 uh, and 2 thirds, uh, or even 3.6 recurring. Okay, but 11 over 3 is fine, 3 and 2 thirds fractions slightly better, slightly more accurate, more useful. Okay, but any of those answers is fine. Okay, uh, slightly trickier this one got a fraction in it, first thing we want to do is get rid of the fraction. So what are we going to do to both sides? Well, we're going to times by 4. So 7 minus 2y times all of this side by 4. That just goes. Then we've got to times all of this side by 4. So let's just multiply that out. Equals 8y plus 12. Then it becomes like a question above. You get the y's on both sides. I'm going to move it over to this side. Um, to get a positive number of y, 7 equals, I'm going to add 2y to both sides, it's 10y plus 12. I'm now going to take 12 off both sides, so I get minus 5 is 10y, and I'm going to divide by 10. Okay, that is minus 5 over 10, that y is minus a half. There we go, y is minus 